Well, I don't think realistically this changes anything that's going to happen, especially next week for the Fed. It is expected they're going to raise probably 50 basis points. There's still about 70 percent odds of that happening. And I think even with these numbers today, the Fed already stated that the strong labor force they already know about, they already know it's a problem. And they said that even this week when they hinted that they might start to pause on or I guess not raise rates quite as high moving forward. And I think realistically the trouble with this is they only can really control demand but not supply in the labor market. And there is like a big problem happening where you look at baby boomers, for example, they've been leaving the labor force about 2.2 million people per year since 2010. And that is happening regardless of what the Fed is doing. So you're going to have a tight labor market, whether they're raising interest rates or not. And I think at a certain point, they have to realize that.